Okay, so let's get this sleepover party started. We had a rough week of school, so we deserve to party it up. Yeah, let's party. And we have Nana Kachan with us too. So now you know it's going to be a fun time. I prefer to think of this as a type of female get-together that continues through the night until the morning. Sleepovers are very juvenile, don't you agree? You calling me juvenile? What's wrong with sleepovers? I go to a lot with my friends from my school. What's so bad about them? For your demographic, there's nothing wrong with the term. For young adults of my age, however, it's rather childish. I bet you're excited just like Chie. <laughs> you can tell the truth, Mr. Naoto. Mr. I'm not a... Ugh, just forget what I said. I'm glad everybody could make it. I'm sure this is going to be a fun night. Yeah! Kung Fu movies and junk food all night long. Kung Fu? Who said anything about Kung Fu? Yukiko, you said we were going to be trying on makeup and giving each other manicures. Wait, wasn't this a Kung Fu movie party? Yukiko, you told me that we were going to play Clue. I'm sorry, Chie. Rize-chan and Naoto-kun aren't into Kung Fu movies that much. So I had to come up with something to get them to join us. Oh man, I wanted to watch movies tonight. I have an idea. We can still watch kung fu movies, play a board game, and do our nails. But we'll have to have some drinks first. What? Uh, are you kidding me? We can't do that. We have Nanako with us. If you guys are going to have grown-up drinks, don't worry about it. My dad goes out to drink every now and then with his friends from the police station. He used to come home with Mr. Adachi all the time, walking all wibbly-wobbly. I'm used to it. I don't know if I should be relieved you're okay with this, or to be really concerned for you, Nanako-chan. <laughs> dad says the funniest thing when he's happy from drinking. Sometimes, he'd say that Big Bro's one great big man whore. He never ever told me what that means, though. Can I have some to drink, too? Absolutely not! This all sounds highly illogical. How could we possibly have fun watching martial arts films when we're intoxicated? Furthermore, how is that a sensible suggestion when we're all minors here? Oh, shush, Naoto! Stop ruining the fun! Ta-da! Are those wine bottles? Uh-huh. You mean you were actually serious about this? You're not really expecting us to drink that stuff, are you? Of course I expect you to drink it. I'm the one who went through the trouble of getting it. I had to call up my agent's friend's friend, who knows this guy, who knows this guy's cousin, to point me to that cousin's uncle's father's liquor store to get the right brand. Oh, okay, um, could you run all that by me again a little slower this time? So what if we have a few drinks? We're supposed to be relaxing after all the crap we've been through this week. I had to write a seven-page book report for something I never read. I had to look at chapter summaries online and BS that thing as best I could. So I want to unwind? I deserve it. Look, I'll show you how it's done. Good stuff. Ooh, I'm starting to get tingles all over. We're seriously not going to do this, are we? Only a fool would participate in this sort of insipid and deplorable behavior. Rize chan, it's rude to hog the bottle. I'd like a glass. Yukiko, not you too! Yeah! Pound it down, Yukiko Senpai! Oh my, that's very strong. Damn, Sampa, you took it down like a champ. Here, have another. Uh, oh, okay. <laughs> wow, Yukiko and Rize's faces are all getting red. They look like cherries. <laughs> 
I'm starting to regret throwing this party. This isn't wine. Wait, it's not? It's just sparkling fruit juice. Grape. There's nothing all that special about it. Bullshit! I paid good money for that. I bought good stuff. Top of the line quality all the way from Liquorland. We're really going to go through this a second time. Didn't we have this problem when I first met you all? You're not getting drunk on the juice. You're only getting drunk off the- Shut up! Shut up or I'll tie your shoesies together! You only had one glass of juice. You can stop pretending now. Hey, Reese! <laughs> Let's get jet faced while we watch this movie! <laughs> Idiots. Hey, don't let me and Nautica John with them. This is the worst late night female get together I've ever experienced. How many sleepover parties have you been to anyway, Naruto? This is my first. I've got a wobbly bunch of coconuts. <laughs> Big one, small one, some as big as you. Don't encourage them, Monica-chan. That new server they got at I is pretty hot, eh, Kanji? I mean, she's got those dumplings. Just me want to go... <laughs> if you know what I mean. No. You're such a press when it comes to women. If Teddy were here, he'd totally get me. And this is why neither of you guys will ever get a girlfriend. Says the guy who can't even get Naoto to notice him. I'm sorry, Yosuke. Can you speak up? It sounds like you're asking me to beat the ever-living shit out of you. saying you could go just now yeah i think so that was pretty loud for us to hear from just down the street they're gonna wake up the whole damn neighborhood hey uh, this is the street che lives on right what are you supposed to be doing here judging from what we just heard i don't think i want to know let's just get going my mom got topsicles from the store the other day they're back at my house or we could find out what the girls are up to Huh? Dude, you know what goes on with girls during drunken hijinks, right? Uh. Oh man, the, the great stuff that's going on over there! Come on, man, let's go check it out for a second! What? Hey, hey, wait up! Alright, cheese room should be up there where that window is. And how do you know that? I've been here enough times doing chores to pay off that DVD I broke a while back. She's definitely up there. Kanji, give me a boost. We're really gonna be peeping through her window? Hey, I wanna know what's going on, so shut up and give me a boost up there. Uh, sure. Yeah. <sighs> Dang it. I can't reach it. Get me up a little higher. <laughs> You think this is easy? Your damn shoes are digging into my shoulders here. Hurry up! Yukiko, put your sweater back on! And... Uh, don't unbutton your shirt! Nanako, don't look! What? What's going on? Nanako-chan's in there! Dude, these chicks are nuts! What the hell's going on? What are they doing? Give me 
me up to the window, Kanji. I still can't see anything. Woohoo! It's getting so hot in here. I'm on fire. Oh, if only Senpai was here. <sighs> I'm tempted to bludgeon you with the butt of my gun. Whoa! Now to come to buddy death. Naoto's in there, too? <laughs> God, you think we hit the jackpot? This is great. I didn't know these girls were like that. And now they're taking away Nanako-chan's innocence. What would Senpai say if he was here right now? Oh, he'd love every minute of this. You know how big that sister complex of his is. This is really pushing it, dude. We should get out of here before something happens. Miss out on this? Hell no, this is quality stuff here. Pure gold. Huh? What's that outside? Is somebody there? Ah, oh, shit, man. Abort, abort! Quit squirming around like that! I'm gonna drop you if you- Yeah! Kanji? Yosuke? What are you two doing outside? Huh? Oh, uh... Huh. Hey, Chie. What are you boys doing here? We, uh, heard some weird noises coming from your house, so we came to figure out what was going on. <laughs> we heard you guys from all the way up the street, so we were worried. <laughs> no, you didn't. Oh, man. Now the whole neighborhood's gonna be awake. Damn it. Who's that outside? Is it the pizza delivery man? Maybe it's the mailman. Bill's here! <laughs> uh, so what's been going on with you guys? Well, I tried throwing a girls' night party with movies and games, but that was kind of a bust. Oh, hi, Kanji! Breezy and Yukiko are drunk off juice! It's really funny. I'm learning so much about being grown up from them. I can't wait until I'm older. You get everything you've heard tonight out of your head, Nanako-chan. Great. When Dojima-san hears about this from Nanako-chan, I'll be dead meat. I'm not the good kind of dead meat either. So, you guys were just playing until Risei and Yukiko messed things up. Like when we were on that school trip? History repeats itself, it seems. Alright, since that's all it is, I guess I'll grab Yosuke and get going. Hey, wait a sec. If you guys were so worried about us, why'd you sneak into my backyard and try to climb through the window? Uh, what? Were you guys hoping to see something? You weren't trying to peep, were you? Well, glad to know everything is fine in the neighborhood. Come on, Yosuke, time to get going. Kanji, I wanna, I wanna see drunken hijinks. You freaking perverts! I'm gonna kill you. Gotta go, bye. Hey, get back here! Ugh, I'm so gonna murder them. <laughs> Rise. That lampshade doesn't belong on your head! I hate you all. Oh, I'm just so sleepy. Me too. Naoto, can I borrow your gun for a minute? Certainly, but I get to use it on myself first. Fair enough. <laughs> <laughs> 